Welcome back to This Is Your Life, and I am Queen Von Che, and I will be doing a reading for the sign of Gemini. Okay, you guys, let's get started. It is February 27th. Okay, let's see, universe. What does Gemini need to know at this moment? What's going on in Gem Gemini's life right now? Can I do one more card for Gemini regarding what's going on in their life right now or what they need, may need to know? That's a lot of cards, bro. Bro. <sighs> Guardian, love spell, spy, cycles, narcissist, guardian, love spell, spy. Very interesting. Um, so far, no sign has got these many cards to come out. All right, Gemini. Right away. What I'm feeling like is going on with you. Obviously, a lot for all these cards to fly out. With cycles being right here. It said, um, it says karma, something ending, something beginning. But then right next to it, we have narcissists. Someone is too full of themselves. So basically what I'm feeling like, Gemini, you could be in a situation where it, it, it's on repeat. It keeps going round and round and round. You're dealing with someone that you shouldn't be dealing with at this point in time in your life, okay? With guardian being right here, it says a lost loved one uh, watches over you, okay? So it you could be in a situation where someone um, may be influencing you in a type of way that's not necessarily who you are as a person. They could have some type of love spell over you. And with spying being right here, it's a, it says someone got their eyes on you and, and doing your research, doing your research. Okay, so this could, this could, for me, this could mean one or two things that the someone is spying on you, but it could also be that your guardian angel is watching over you and trying to protect you with all of this stuff that's going on with this um, cycles, with this narcissist. But, and then we have communication at the um, the bottom of the deck, okay? So it could definitely be lack of communication um, in the relationship. They could be wanting to that communication card says compromise, forgive, and work it out. So, yeah, and I think that's probably what you're constantly doing in this situation with this narcissist person. Um, he's He or she is constantly communicating with you uh, for you to continue to go round and round in these cycles with this narcissist, okay? This is probably the things that they be saying. Um, please forgive me. Can, can we work it out? Let's compromise. You know, it could be a situation like that for you, Gemini. But with your guardian angel, they watching over you. Because this is not the type of characteristic that you display as normal. Okay. Um, device, can I please get like three cards, three to four cards for okay. 
Then I get two more cards for um, Gemini regarding the spread. What else does Gemini need? A source wants to talk about that it didn't come on way. Can I get two more cards, please, uh, for a confirmation for this spread for Gemini? Can I get a card for this love spell being right here for Gemini? Anything else Gemini needs to know right now? We got a new spell. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Okay, uh, Gemini. So, the card that did come out was the Two of Cups. And it came out in the um, correct position. Okay. So, um, the person that you could possibly be dealing with, uh, Gemini, they could definitely be a, a, a water sign. Okay. So, they could be a Cancer. They could possibly be a Scorpio um, or a Pisces. Okay. And... This card says, it's in the upright position, and it says unified love, partnership, uh, mutual attraction, and connection. And this could be the communication. This could be what the guy is telling you. Or I keep saying guy, so I was be talking to a female, Gemini, again. This could be the things that this person is telling you, which is why you constantly in this cycle with this person. It ends, it begins, it ends, it begins because of the things that they promised you. But I don't, it doesn't seem as if um, that's all that it is. It's, it's, it's broken promises. They don't, they don't keep them. Okay. They don't keep them. Jeez. I the a higher thing up to come out. Can I get a couple of more cards for Gemini regarding this um, spread when it comes to these cycles and these narcissists or the guardian angel, the love spells, the spy? Can I get a couple of more cards for Gemini, please, Gemini? What does Gemini need to know right now? Is there anything else, Gemini? Needs to know right now. Okay, so we got moving on. Okay, and um, this is um, um Pisces uh, right here. So we, we got more water right here, and it says moving on, and it says um, as uh, what's the, what did I say? I forgot what I said. But anyway, uh, it says no on here, okay? And it says um, uh, um, letting go, traveling, reaching your limits, okay? Discovering yourself, okay? Looking deeper within. Um, it, it also says looking for the truth. So, yeah, you're going you're gonna to be moving on, um, Gemini, from this person, um, that you're attached to. And like I said, they could definitely be a water sign with the two of cups coming out here. Okay. And now we have the uh, eight of cups coming out as well. I could be talking to someone that could be 28. Two or eight could be significant in this situation. Okay. And then at the bottom of the deck, we have the, um, we have the devil card and it's actually in the reverse. It's in the reverse, okay? And it says release from um, bondage, removing the chains, okay? Uh, feeling at the end of your rope. So yeah, you could be you could be tired of this, and your guardian your guardian angels could be tired of um, um, watching you go through what you're going through, okay? They're tired of it. They don't want to see you. They don't want to see you going through this. Yeah. What else can we see? What else can we see? Um, going on with you, Gemini. I didn't 
to this card, so I'm going to make that. Did I get three cards for Gemini regarding this narcissist? Ooh. This, this card right here wants to come out. It says courthouse, but it didn't come all the way out. So this could also be a person that you may um, had legal issues with or um, they could have been going back and forth to jail and you would have to go down to the courthouse. <laughs> Look, this wants to pop out. <laughs> what does it say? Imprisonment. See? See? See what I'm talking about? That's what I'm talking about, man. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, leave this, leave this narcissist alone. You can find someone better. You deserve better. You don't have to go through what you're going through. Okay, Gemini? Look within yourself. You wouldn't treat yourself like that. Uh -oh. What is that? Mm-hmm. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Listen. We got um 26 and it says great fortune. But didn't I just say it's something better for you out there? Great fortune, and it landed right over here with your um your guardian. It says a lost loved one watches over you. There's great fortune coming towards you. You just have to and, and since we're talking about like love, it, it could be finance, whatever it is you want, but something great is coming towards you, okay? You just have to get out of these cycles if that's what it is that you um, desire, um, Gemini. Let me, um, I don't think there's nothing else, Gemini, for you from me. So I'm going to close your reading out right here with these wisdom of oracles okay i've been asking for one card they've been doing what they want to do so let's just see what they're going to do for you can i get one card please damn what is that mm, it's a magic oh. to be fair yeah, you got, um, it says number 38, and it says to be fair. Okay. And for me, uh, Gemini, what this means is you've been in a situation that hasn't been fair for you. And it's time for things to be fair, for things to work out in your favor. It's kind of like this is this is supposed to happen for you. Okay, with this great fortune being here, just like be fair. So don't don't feel as is because this with this narcissist person, they could try to um and then look at the bottom of the deck. Happy, happy. <laughs> this with this narcissist person, they could probably try to make you feel unhappy. But it says happy, happy. Okay, this is what you have coming towards you. Happy, happy, and great fortune. And this narcissist person could try to um, keep you in this cycle, okay? They could probably try to make you feel um, make you feel some type of way and try to in order to try to get you to continue to um, repeat the cycle. And it's like, no, nah, you know what I'm saying? Let's be fair, you know what I'm saying? I done done this with you over and over and over again. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is, okay? Do all right, man. With that being said, I am um, Queen Von Shay. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I thank you for your continued support.